Welcome back to the Alpha Strike, everybody, for another episode of Mike Nito's New Recruits. Yes, I'm sorry I've been out for a little while. It does take a little bit to make sure these new recruits are the top of the line to make sure that when I put them up, there is no question that they have the capabilities of being totally and completely meta-worthy. So, our recruit today, we've talked about him quite a bit. You've seen him in action in the battle boxes, bringing to you Cable from Deadpool and X-Force number... 14. He just has a slew of keywords to start off with. New Mutants, Six Pack, X Force, X Men, Armor, Future, and Soldier. That is just amazing for keywords. I can think of a ton of teams to put him on. Has the X Men TA, has Ignore, Hindering Train for Movement Purposes, and Traded Stealth. Uh, he is 120 points. With the dial you see there, this figure brings so much to the table. Very similar to uh, the Joker uh, from. Joker's Wild that made our new recruits at 140. He comes in at 120, and it is just undeniable what you can do with this guy. Being able to do his special body slide maneuver where he can move five squares with phase teleport, that ignores everything, and take a regular range combat attack. Um, so you can't pen side with that, but he still has that probability control backup and four damage. With his defensive power, he gets invulnerability, period. When he has less than two action tokens, so you've done your body slide five squares, you have stealth, and if you some reason didn't land in hindering terrain, you now have energy shield deflection to get you up to a 19. So if they're busting your stealth, well, you're still getting a 19 defense at that range. He's just, that, that open click is so much. He has so many strengths going for him. Then you follow through with a, a penetrating psychic blast because he's got the willpower, and then he drops into a running shot, goes to energy explosion, and range combat expert. So if they did hit him at range, which... Good luck with that, with his 7 range, with probability control backup. He just turns into a ridiculous turret at that point. Picks up his uh, body slide mid-dial again so you can get him in or out at that point. And then if he's far enough down, they're thinking you've probably been based. Now he's got flurry and or exploit weakness. Granted, only 9 attack, but you're, you're breaking him down. You're either punching him twice for 2 or you're exploiting them for 2. If he does just happen to end up on his last click. Um, he's got regen with probability control and the ability to body slide away. So again, you just face teleport away and you go into the hindering terrain, take a turn, regen, and then get back in the fight. You also have that X-Men to cover that up as well. Uh, overall weaknesses, if he uh, takes a good hit at the beginning and you get him off that invulnerable, it's only gonna take one more tap to take him down. So, I mean, you can glass draw McGraw for two hits, but the chances of you getting through that 19 defense at range with invulnerable are ridiculous. So, really, you have to watch your positioning with him. Make sure he's in the right place at the right time. To make him better, I don't even know that I can. He's got everything he needs with his 120 points. Um, pair him with some other X-Men people for backup to be able to heal him. Give him some secondary attackers, maybe some support to get him where he needs to be or a perplex or two. That is Cable in a nutshell for Mike Nito's new recruits. Now, because this is the first common to make Mike Nito's new recruits, I have a very special giveaway for the viewers of the Alpha Strike. I have seven additional cables from my polls that I am willing to give away to those who need it. So if you don't have one and are needing one, to add to your collection, didn't have a chance to buy one, weren't lucky enough to pull a common, comment below. The first seven people who want to claim a cable will get your information and get one sent out to you. Um, and then just be sure to like our page and uh, comment, tell us how we're doing, and uh, you know, I appreciate you guys watching us. And remember, until next time, strike first and strike hard.